Could artificial intelligence or AI destroy humanity? Well, one Brussels-based group believes so, and they've been actively trying to lobby the European Union into stopping the rollout of more powerful artificial intelligence systems. In the past few months, new tools such as ChatGPT have raised fears that AI will lead to millions of people losing their jobs or the generation of disinformation, especially during elections. But according to the founder of Pause AI, these powerful systems could very soon outsmart us. And if people try to interfere or shut them down, well, these technologies could even resist. Companies could eventually give AI systems more autonomy and connect them to certain vital infrastructures, such as, for example, the power grid, as well as certain weapons. And that's why the founder of Pause AI is also asking the EU to organize an international summit on this subject. Number one thing is to call for one government to ste step up, organize a summit and implement a moratorium, a pause on AI development of these dangerous systems. And that needs to happen on an international level, because if you do it on a national level, uh, there will be a lot of arguments against doing so. Uh, nations compete just like companies compete. We can't just ask nicely for co of companies to, to, to stop their AI development because they have a lot of competitive pressure. And the same happens on a national level too. So we need to do this on an international level. That's why we need to do this summit. And Pause AI aren't the only ones to ring alarm bells on this issue. In June, Rishi Sunak, the UK Prime Minister, became one of the first world leaders to acknowledge the potential existential threat of developing a superintelligent AI without appropriate safeguards. And recently, hundreds of researchers and executives working in tech published this open letter warning that AI could one day destroy humanity. But some argued that AI is still too underdeveloped to pose a real existential threat and that short-term problems such as, for example, uh, biased and incorrect answers are the biggest issues right now. Sam Altman, CEO of OpenAI, which developed ChatGPT, said that while artificial intelligence could be beneficial to humans, regulating it is essential.